Kuchi Sakiana. Jack and Danielle were happily living with their two children, Nick and Eric, in Hiroshima City, Japan. Mommy, mommy, I have to go to the garden. No, son, it's too late. Don't go out now. We'll go to the garden tomorrow. Let us go, mommy. Both of us will go. We'll play cricket for a while and come back. Okay, go. But promise me you'll take care of your younger brother, Eric. Promise, mommy. And both brothers come to the garden for a while and are jumping and playing around a lot. They didn't realize that a beautiful masked woman was watching them both play. When she saw Eric, her eyes began to glow. The boys began to play cricket. Yay, I hit a sixer! Eric, don't hit the ball too hard. I don't want to have to run really far to go get it. Nick feels that someone is standing behind him, but when he turns around, no one is there. While the boys play cricket, the woman with the mask slowly moves towards Eric. She is constantly staring at Eric. When she moves, it is though she floats through the air. Suddenly, Eric hits the ball hard, far outside of the garden. What did you do, Eric? You hit the ball so far! I told you I wouldn't go get it. The wind is blowing the masked woman's hair. But her gaze is fixed on the boy Eric. She glides towards him. But as soon as Nick looks in her direction, she disappears. Sorry, brother. <sighs> it's okay. I'll go get the ball. You stay right here. Don't go anywhere. Nick goes to look for the ball outside of the garden, while Eric stands there silently and alone. Suddenly, the woman comes and stands behind Eric. Who are you? Why do you Why want to know who I am? Just tell me. Am I beautiful? Eric is confused and just stares at the masked woman. Suddenly, she flies up in the air a little and starts laughing aloud. Her eyes start shining. <laughs> Am I beautiful? Y yes. As soon as he answers this, the woman wearing the mask started laughing aloud and slowly removed her mask from her face. Her whole face. <laughs> Eric is shocked to see her. Her face is impaired and her face is cut off in the middle. Her facial wounds seem very fresh, and it seems like blood will start bleeding at any moment. Her hair suddenly starts flying in the air, and her eyes turn red all over. She floats in the air. Slowly, her feet turn around backwards. <laughs> Am I, Am I still beautiful? Eric is afraid and begins to sweat. <laughs> Tell me, am I still beautiful? If I say no, she'll probably kill me. I had better say yes again. Yes! <laughs> The masked woman takes out a large pair of scissors and strikes Eric with them so that his face is cut from the middle of his lips just like the woman. Blood starts coming out of Eric's mouth and he starts to suffer. He falls down to the ground in pain. The masked woman disappears, but her laughter can be heard echoing in the distance. Then, Nick returns with the ball. Eric! Eric, why have you fallen? Nick screams when he sees Eric's face, and he's horrified. He runs straight towards his house. 
His family comes hurriedly to the garden. Eric, my child! What happened to you? Don't panic, Danielle. We'll take him to the hospital. Some people in the crowd are looking at the boy with panic. Then an old lady comes ahead and speaks. Looks like this is Anna's work. She has returned. She has come back. Anna? Kuchisaki, Anna. Nothing can be done now. Your son has died. Take him home and grieve. And always remember the evil masked woman. And the creepy old lady, that would be me. No, no, this can't be happening. Who is this masked woman? We don't even know her. Then the police arrived. After a thorough examination, they give the body back to Jack and Danielle. Take your son's body. We have investigated. Both Jack and Danielle bury their son and arrive at the police station again. Yes? Sir, our son was killed by a woman. Why don't you catch her? Look, Danielle, we can catch a person who's alive, but this is not the first case. This is the 125th case. The police investigation is going on, and Kuchisaki again captures a child in the Nagasaki city. Am I beautiful? beautiful? And Kuchisaki kills him as well. <laughs> Your son has been killed by a ghost. We can't imprison a ghost, and she's probably already in another place, taking another life by now. But why? Kuchisaki Anna? You you don't know about her? Let me tell you the legend. A long time ago, there used to be a woman named Kuchisaki in Japan. She was very beautiful, and she boasted about it more and more every day. She was married to a samurai. Kuchisaki, you are so beautiful and I so lucky to have you. I am the prettiest woman in the whole world. You should be proud of me and my beauty. A few years later, the samurai had to go fight a war. Kuchi, now I have to go to battle. You take care of yourself and yes, keep writing me letters. I love you. I love you too. The samurai was at war for a long time. Initially, Kuchisaki used to send letters to him. But slowly, those letters stopped coming. But slowly, those letters stopped coming. On the other hand, Kuchisaki, too, had broken all boundaries of misconduct. Kuchi, you are very beautiful. You should become mine. I'll be yours. But only for one night. (laughs) I do not want to share too much of my beauty with anyone. Meanwhile, at war, the samurai received a letter from his good friend, who wrote to tell him everything about Kuchisaki. No, you can't do this to me. You are only mine. Only. A few days later, he returns home and sees a man with his wife in his house. Who was this? And why has he come to my house? I trusted you with my heart. My friend told me everything about you. He kills the man in the room and slowly moves towards Kuchisaki. No, what are you doing? Don't come any closer. The angry samurai walked towards her and took out his katana. You are very proud of your beauty, right? You consider yourself most beautiful woman in the world, so take this! In a fit of rage, the samurai moves forward, strikes Kuchisaki's face, and cuts her face from the middle of her lips. The face starts bleeding rapidly. Kuchisaki is suffering. Why did you hit me? Go, 
Now show your face to everyone. Don't you seduce everyone with that face? No one will think you are beautiful now. Kuchisaki looks at herself in the mirror. Her face has become completely disfigured. No. no, 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 no. I'm, I'm beautiful. beautiful. I'm very I'm beautiful. beautiful. Speaking of this, Kuchisaki ran away from there to save her life. But she died. I'm beautiful. This is the same Kuchisaki. She has come back after so many years. And she is avenging her death now. That's really strange. Why target children? We don't know. She just asks, am I beautiful? If you say no, then she kills you. And if you say yes, then she cuts your face and kills you. And if you're not sure, she'll follow you home and kill you there. So it doesn't really matter. Whatever you say, she'll end up killing you. So what do we do now? You? Nothing. Even the greatest paranormal experts have not been able to trace her. You're not going to do anything? Just let her go? I will only say that you should go get a ghost expert and pray that everyone should be free from the terror of Kuchisaki. It is said that Kuchisaki continued to terrorize Japan and kill children for many years. Am I beautiful? N -n -n no. <laughs> Until one day, she finally disappeared. Even today, people are surprised, wondering why did she come? And if she had come, and why did she leave? And if she left? The end.